Hey, this is Tim Coburn with TimCoburnPhoto.com and today I'm going to tell you the best lens for motorsport photography. When you're choosing your lenses, really the one thing to think about is where you're going to be on the track. That is really key on the type of lens that you're going to shoot. Overall, you're going to want a fast lens. The faster, the better. If you have a lens like 5.6, that's probably not fast enough. You're going to want something 2.8 or faster and I'll tell you later in the video why. If you're lucky enough to get close to the track, if you've got a press pass or you know someone who knows someone at the track, you can probably get away with a wide lens. Something like 70 millimeter to 200 millimeter. Right here I've got my 24 to 70. You can probably shoot with this lens if you're lucky enough to get close to the track. Most of us are probably not going to get that close. So you're going to want a long lens. The longer lens, the better actually. You'll want to pick up something that's at least 100 millimeters. This is probably the shortest lens you're going to want to go with. This is a 100 millimeter prime lens, and this is probably the minimum you're going to need for shooting motorsports photography. Really, you would like to get a zoom, something like 100 to 400, because you really want to be able to get in there on the action and get the shot. Now, since you're going to be using these long lenses, you're going to want what's called a monopod. This is similar to a tripod, but easier to maneuver. While tripods have three different legs, a monopod has one leg and you can easily move it as you're shooting. You're going to want to use this because you're going to be standing around for quite a while waiting for these cars to come by. And as you're waiting, your 400 millimeter lens is going to get heavier and heavier and heavier. So you're going to want to have that monopod so you can be able to hold it there and rest your arms on it so you're waiting for the cars to come by. Now earlier in the video I talked about speed is key. And this is true because if you're using a slow lens and fast moving cars, you're not going to get the best shot. If you've got something like a 2.8 lens, you're going to be able to have a nice shallow depth of field. This is going to bring your car into focus while throwing the crowd out of focus and it's going to make the shot beautiful. So the faster lens you can get your hands on, the better. This is Tim Coburn with TimCoburnPhoto.com and today I told you the best lens to use for motorsport photography.